triple covalent bond. Well, it's a covalent bond, in which one electron is contributed, by each bonded atom. Let's take hydrogen as an example. Hydrogen has one electron in its outermost shell and needs, one more electron. When two hydrogen atoms come together they share their electrons, to form one bond pair known as single covalent bond. This single bond pair is represented by a single line, between two atoms. Now the second type of covalent bond is known as, double covalent bond. In this type of covalent bond, two pairs of electrons are shared between, two atoms. Let's take oxygen as an example. Oxygen has six electrons in its outer shell, and it needs two more electrons to become stable. So when two oxygen atoms come together, to form a molecule, they share two pairs of electrons through a double covalent bond. This allows both oxygen atoms to achieve stability, by filling up their outer shells with 